question number uh, 23 uh, it's about the right issue in 2012 the pandora box company made a right issue at five dollar a share of one new shares for every four share held. so we are giving one new share for every four share holds. before the issue there were 10 million shares outstanding and the share price was six dollars so requirement number one what was the total amount of new money raised so to calculate the new money raised we first need the number of new shares that will be issued so new shares for this purpose we will take the number of old shares which are uh, 10 million right and uh, divide it with 4 because we are issuing one new shares for every four shares held by an individual so the number of new shares will be 2.5 million right so uh, our question is the total amount of new money raised so then uh, now we can calculate the new money so this will be the new shares multiplied by the uh, right issue price that is five dollars okay so by multiplying it uh, we will have 12.5 million dollars that's it coming to the part b the right issue gave the shareholders the opportunity to buy one new shares for less than the market price. What was the value of this opportunity? So uh, the share price is currently the share price is six dollars, right? And uh, the shareholders have been given an option to buy the right at five dollars. So the question is asking what is the value of this discount or how much benefit the shareholders will get if there is any. So uh, the share uh, to calculate the share value or right value or opportunity value. will be equal to the share price or current share price minus the right issue price then we will divide it with the new number of shares so new number of shares will be n the old shares plus the one new shares given to the shareholders so uh, the current share price is six dollars given right here minus the old share price is five dollars right the number of whole share n is 4 plus the new one share have been given so by calculating all this this will be 1 over 5 which will be 0 0.20 dollars 
so this is the value of uh, right issue or this opportunity so this is the discount they are getting then uh, the part C what was the prospective stock price after the issue so uh, to calculate the stock price we need the same information right uh, we have seen in the previous question so stock price is equal to market value or total value whatever you want to call it we uh, let's say it the total value and divide it with the total number of shares so to calculate the total value we need the old shares which were 10 million and multiply them with the old share price which is 6 plus uh, we need the new uh, number of shares which were 2.5 million and multiply them with the uh, right issue value that was five dollars and divide it with the total number of shares uh, which are 10 million plus <coughs> uh, 2.5 million so by solving all this you can reach to the uh, share uh, stock price which will be 5.8 zero so you can reconcile the answer in the previous part opportunity value is 0 0.20 and the stock price uh, will uh, fall to 5.80 after the new issue but this uh, new issue will uh, not impact uh, your value for example if you had a uh, four shares uh, each shares will be valued six dollars so it will become 24 right <coughs> now uh, what you have done is you bought a one new share at a price of five so by adding this you have 29 dollar worth in the company by seeing the new share price, uh, now you have a five shares, right? And the share price is 5.80. It should also come 29. So if you are accepting the right issue, then uh, your uh, value or your worth will not change. But if you reject the right issue, then your value uh, will decrease by 0 0.20 dollars right because you haven't bought the share at five dollars and after the issue the price of all the shares will fall to 5.80 so you have lost 0 0.20 so that's why uh, shareholders never uh, reject this right issue they always accept this right issue offer so uh, let's uh, get back to our questions part d how far could the total value of the company fall before the shareholders would be unwilling to take up their rights so if the shareholders are uh, not willing to buy the shares at five dollars then the market uh, will think that share might be uh, the right issue might not be the worth uh, then the share price which is currently at six is expected to fall uh, to the price of five uh, which is the offer price of the share so uh, the the company is not issuing the new shares because nobody is willing to buy the everyone is unwilling so no new shares will be issued 
So the company's total value will be the 10 million old shares and the price will drop to five dollars so the total uh, wealth of the company uh, total value of the company will be five million okay